Hi everyone, welcome to today's video. Today we would be discussing about a, a candlestick pattern which is known as advanced block pattern. So let's uh, directly dive into it. Okay. Um, so suppose that I have a bearish market, uh, I have a bullish market which is getting formed. So basically the stocks are moving in the upward direction. And after that, what I see is I see a big green candle. Okay. And then I see a, a big green candle, but this candle is smaller than the previous candle. And then what I see is I see a green doji. Okay. Uh, now, these are candles. Now, one thing that you will notice is the wicks of, this, of these candles are actually, um, you know, creating a lot of high and then pushing the price back. So the sellers are actually, the buyers are actually trying to push the uh, price upwards, but the sellers are pushing the price back and moving the price even down. And then you see a doji. If this kind of pattern happens and in the next, um, you know, candle, if you see a red uh, candle being formed, then this kind of pattern is known as advanced block pattern. Now, what exactly can uh, you guess? Can you guess what exactly is going to happen? the market is going to reverse the market is going uh, now going to go downwards of course you have to use rsi and see whether um, it is an oversold or overbought zone but this is what exactly advanced block uh, suggests now what exactly is happening over here let's try to understand the micro market psychology behind it um, so what exactly was happening is that there was a uh, bullish trend which was going on so there was an upward trend which was going on now, there was a very large candle, so the buyers were in power right now, and the seller started pushing the price downwards. That's why you see that there was a, a high which was uh, getting formed, and then the seller pushed it down. So, you, uh, you can expect that the sellers were now trying to uh, reverse this particular stock. And they try to push it downwards. Now, this is again confirmed by this particular candle where you can see that the sellers are now even, uh, you know, squeezing the buyers and the candles width is actually becoming very low or very, very shallow. And of course, it's a doji. So you can expect a, a market reversal over here. And this ultimately the sellers were actually able to overpower the buyers uh, you know over here and there was a red candle which was formed so therefore there's a very high probability that there's a market reversal which is going to happen now and you can actually start uh, shorting this particular stock at this particular price point uh, now what will be my uh, stop loss this particular level will be my stop loss and i will uh, you know, uh, get out of this trade if price reverses and moves above this particular price point. Otherwise, I'll book my profit. I'll, uh, you know, let the uh, price fall and I will keep on booking the profits. Okay, let's now take an example of advanced block, uh, how exactly it happens. So this is an example of advanced block. So now you can see that there was a bullish pattern from here to here. And you see that this particular wick was green and the bull were in very much power, right? Here you see that, uh, you know, the um, uh, bears have actually started in the next candle. The bears have actually started pushing the price down. And here you see that, okay, there's, uh, you know, a very small green candle which has been formed. And the next day you see that the sellers have actually overpowered the buyers. And then you can see that over a long time, there was a bullish, uh, there was a bearish pattern which was getting formed. So this is all about advanced block and uh, I hope to see you guys in the next one.